What's good, y'all? This is Nate Dog, and uh, yeah, overclock the motherfucker fully on the GTX 2060 or 260, however you want to say it. And let me get that out of the way. So, uh, yeah, got Black Ops 2 going. And this would be for Batman when I had it overclocked just a little bit. It was getting me 50 and 60 back and forth. Surprisingly, a smooth frame rate. Now, after like two minutes of just standing around, looking around, it shit shut down on me. So, um, yeah, and for, I would say, Revenue 6, haven't started it up yet, but I am sure it may not make any difference, or may freeze up, don't really know, ain't trying it, plus it takes too long to get into it, but for Watch Dogs, still not working, and for Borderlands the pre-sequel it was playing and then basically no frame rates went up it just stuck around 30 frames basically in 20s so um, even with everything overclock fully overclock didn't make no difference so now for Borderlands 1 was getting overclocked not fully, but just about. It was hitting the 60 and higher. And then all of a sudden, it just quit. It just stopped. So, I mean, it just getting 30 frames, 25 frames, 24. And back to like 32. So, around there. So, it's pretty jumpy. And pretty laggy. But, um, yeah. Now more Black Ops 2, and I'm going to see what happens. So we'll just go ahead and see what the frame rate will be at 720, well no, 1080. Let me show you my settings. This is what I'm getting now. 61. At resolution... Trying to go back, my right, I mean, left top trigger is fucked up. Can't wait to get a new one. Been trying so hard, but nobody ain't trying to sell no damn controller. They're trying to get more than what it's actually worth. So, uh, yeah. 1080, everything at low settings. see what we get if we can hit over a hundred frames per second like a motherfucker and I am using my Xbox One controller as you can see now come on start up can't wait to see these frame rates will I make it over 70 frames per second if I hit 80 or higher, I'm gonna be fucking what, bitch? Everything is fully maxed out on the video card. RAM, overclock, which is gigahertz. Let's see what we get when we enter in. Son of my bitch. <laughs> okay, uh, huh. Hmm. Yeah. That is not good. I hope I don't die here. Let's walk around. So most I've seen was about 50. So yeah, about 50. Let me go inside. I 
sure it's gonna bounce up close quarters and all no so about 50 was the highest Amazing. that's what everything overclock so um uh, yeah don't know that is crazily strange well once I get my new video card which I am closer to getting it I can use the money that I have now and will get the other half as soon as I get all that straightened up uh... yeah uh -huh. I already paid the money for what I supposed to get down so all I have to do now is just pay that one more payment for something and the rest of the money I could get me another I mean I could upgrade my shit now I'm just trying to see what I need to do before I just go ahead and put money into the computer you know so uh yeah I will let y'all most definitely know on that if I can get the upgrade early or wait but this is the review on everything fully overclocked on the GPU. Do it make a difference? Some games, yes. Do it make a difference on all games? No, obviously not. And that's for any computer. So, um, yeah. Would this video card be worth buying for 100 or $98? Fuck no. I would say, but if you're on a tight budget and you really need a video card because yours just died or yours is older and you just don't have that much money, should you spend your money on this? Yeah, go ahead. But if you can find something basic for the same price, it's a little bit better and make sure it's for gaming or whatever you're looking for, yeah, go ahead and go with that. But make sure you do a review on it on YouTube or something to make sure you ain't fucking up. But, uh, yeah, I should try and spend some money and go with the 970. Now, if you're going higher up, just make sure you do your review on the shit before you buy it. Don't say, oh, this is that price. This got this and that many specs. Oh, I'm going to go ahead and get it. No, fuck that. Go ahead and do a review on six different things that's basically for the same price maybe a little higher maybe a little lower go ahead and do reviews on all of those and look at the specs and the frames per second and the video quality and the upgrades you can be able to do to it before you even pay for it think ahead always think ahead before you do some shit like that so uh yeah that's what's going on with this I expected more frames really I did I think I just got a, uh, I don't know, but um, yeah, anyways though, this is Nate Dog. hope y'all enjoyed, and uh, yeah, that's what's going on with this, but yeah, y'all have a good one, and peace.